World Health Organization officials warned on Monday that the highly contagious Delta variant is the fastest and fittest coronavirus strain yet and it will pick off the most vulnerable people, especially in places with low COVID-19 vaccination rates. Dr. Mike Rand, executive director of the World Health Organization's Health Emergencies Program, said during a news conference that Delta variant has the potential to be more lethal because it's more efficient in the way it transmits between humans and it will eventually find those vulnerable individuals who will become severely ill have to be hospitalized and potentially die. The World Health Organization said on Friday that Delta is becoming the dominant variant of the coronavirus disease worldwide. So what is a variant? All viruses, including sars cov 2 the virus that causes COVID-19, evolve over time. When a virus replicates or makes copies of itself, it sometimes changes a little bit, which is normal for a virus. These changes are called mutations. A virus with one or more mutations is referred to as a variant of the original virus. The Delta variant, also known as lineage B16172, is a variant of lineage B1617 of sars cov 2 the virus that causes COVID-19. It was first detected in India in late 2020. The World Health Organization named it the Delta variant on 31st May 2021. It has mutations in the gene encoding the sars cov 2 spike protein, which are known to affect transmissibility of the virus as well as whether it can be neutralized by antibodies for previously circulating variants of the coronavirus. Our WHO official said on Monday that COVID-19 vaccines are less effective against the Delta variant. However, they admitted that the vaccines still prevent severe disease and death. Delta is now replacing Alpha variant, which was the highly contagious variant that swept across Europe and later the US earlier this year. Studies suggest it is around 60% more transmissible than Alpha, which was more contagious than the original strain that emerged from Wuhan, China in late 2019. WHO's technical lead for COVID says Delta has now spread to 92 countries. And according to CDC, it now makes up at least 10% of all new cases in the United States and is on its way to becoming the dominant variant in the nation. The CDC's updated list of symptoms for COVID includes headache, fatigue, muscle or body aches, a sore throat, congestion or runny nose, nausea or vomiting, and diarrhea as possible symptoms of infection. But according to experts, the Delta variant appears to be provoking a different range of symptoms.